Residents of Christchurch Support Hills are being asked to conserve as much water as possible over the next week until the water levels and reservoirs are restored. There's increased pressure on the water supply because firefighters have been using waters from the reservoirs to put out the blaze, of course. Anne Kennett is one of many residents who was evacuated on Hoon Hay Valley Road. Miss Kennett, who's just returned to her home, told our reporter Adriana Weber the fires came within metres of her house with the heat melting her water pipes. I thought that the fire had got to this area across here. So when I saw, when we drove in and I saw it there, I was like, oh my God, you know, it was, I was somewhat freaked out, but only momentarily because it's like, well, there's the fire, the house is still there. And it is literally metres from your house. It is, yes. How lucky do you feel that it didn't take, oh, take look, you home? extremely lucky, but it, the, it's, it's the fire the fire service that needs to be have with credit. I mean, we had this meeting yesterday and the, um, they talked about what what they did here and it was just amazing. I mean, they just put all their effort into it right along all of the houses in the valley and just went at it for hours. And as you can see, they contained it for, in both sides of the... I think this one might have blown itself out, but, you know, they, they saved all the houses. The ones up the back that have gone, I think it, they got in too late. Um, I think the fire came over, and there's just no way that was it. they were ever going to um, to save it. But it, it's apparently it was. Sorry. Right. <laughs> oh, good. Thank you. Right. <laughs> Our water pipes melted. <laughs> Your water pipes melted. <laughs> so that we've just had to put. Uh, yes. Yeah, so we haven't had water for the last couple of days. So we've just been sorting all that out. <laughs> but they're up just around the the back through here, even clo you know, closer to the fire than what. We were, then we're standing, so yeah, we had a little bit of a water issue. But has there yeah. been any other damage to your home? No, we had no smoke and smell of smoke inside, and we had no ash. So amazing, given that it was so close. There's a little bit of um, you can see there's embers are burnt through in the uh, sail across the sparvel, <laughs> but that's it. And some um, burnt pine needles in the swimming pool and up and around here, but nothing. You wouldn't from you wouldn't know around in the house that there'd been a fire so close. That was Anne Kennett talking to Adriana Weber. Just a reminder, residents of Christchurch's Port Hills are being asked to conserve as much water as possible over the next week until the water levels in those reservoirs are restored.